are so many changes up in there and to like stay on top of that these guys are they are beyond professionals the fact that these guys can do what they do and not miss a single beat, and I know I've said it before, this is insane! Yo, what is going on, everybody? Welcome to another episode of React Attack. I am Ords, and today we continue our 30 days of Nightwish with Shudder Before the Beautiful. Epic freaking name for a song, can I just say that? So I did listen to the first, like, five seconds of the song uh, just to kind of get the vibe. I think this one's going to be epic. Um, I know some of you guys have made suggestions in the comments, and we are going to get to those. I do have them on the list, so no worries there, guys. We are going to get to them, so stay tuned. But this one sounds really cool. This one sounds a little bit more different than what I'm used to hearing. So I want to react to this one. Uh, let's get into it, guys. This is Shudder Before the Beautiful, official live by Nightwish. Let's go. The deepest solace lies turn in this the up, baby. Always got to turn up. This ancient unseen stream, a shudder before the beautiful. Ooh. <laughs> And this right here is why I wanted to listen to this one because it, it's so different than what, what I've heard before, man. It's and it, Let's just go. This is the epic. It's more of that keyboard than relying on the guitars, you know? More of that operatic vibe. Love the blue lights. Oh, yeah! And the crowd's jamming, baby! Oh, there's the guitar. Sounds so good. Woo! There she is, baby. Let's go. So this must be like the opening of the the show. This must be the first song. And to come out with this, the whole crowd. Oh, the lights are going up, man. I love it. Love the outfit. I absolutely love this register that Floor's voice is in. I absolutely love this register. Uh, it's very smooth, silky. Not that she isn't always, but just the way it fits with this music so well. Um, this is definitely giving me like some real punk rock vibes in a sense of like that progressive, like do da do do da do da do do da. Right? You know what I'm saying? Um, but with that nice, like you know, you got the guitar in there, which just really fills in beautifully. Um, and then her vocals, man. She's just this is a good warm up song, I think, man. Let's go. You know, sorry, and I keep stopping it. You guys are probably annoyed. I'll, I'll rewind it a little bit here. But uh, I, I I, think what I like about it in this one is that it's not so much of the apparatic voice that we get with Floor in this one. It's just more of like a rock voice with it. I like that, man. Let's go. I won't pause it for a while, okay? <laughs> and them two together? Oh! <laughs> the drummer. I love that she headbangs like that, dude. I love that she's into it. You know what her voice reminds me of? It reminds me of like some like sexy ass, badass eighties like metal chick, right? Like Lita Ford or some cool shit like that. Like that's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh, is that a tree? I like the his He's always got some kind of different keyboard stand going on. I love it. Ooh, I 
like that. I like that. That's a dope sound. It's like shooting through the stars shit. Oh, that was bad. What the heck? There's so many changes up in there, and to like stay on top of that, these guys are they are beyond professionals. The fact that these guys can do what they do and not miss a single beat, and I know I've said it before, this is insane. A little bit of a tempo difference there. I love her vocals in this track, man. I love her vocals here. Dude, that drummer is sick. It's not the original drummer, I don't think, but that dude is sick. Oh, we're slowing it down now. Okay. <laughs> that was awesome. What? Oh, that's it's a human that's spread out on his keyboard. Okay. Or his body of something. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> Marco and Floor's voice together, man. I love this. It's so awesome. The blue lights. All right, you cannot be a night wish and have epilepsy. I'm just saying that. With this light show, like I, I like if you have epilepsy, be careful at the show. talking about yeah that was freaking sick man i don't I'm, I'm i'm right now i'm gonna say right now to everybody i will see this band live before i die and before they well hopefully they'll never end being a band but i'm going to see these guys live i don't care if i have to fly overseas to do it or gotta wait till they're here in america i do not care i am going to see nightwish live next time that they're uh touring so 
Uh, I'm looking very forward to that, dude. This band kicks so much ass. Anyway, guys, let me know in the comments down below what you guys' thoughts are. Thank you all for coming in, showing love, hitting the buttons and all that good shit. I appreciate every single one of you, man. You Nightwish fans are absolutely amazing, and I'm so so happy to be a part of it, too. So thank you guys for everything, man. I, learning about this band has been an absolute pleasure, and I can't wait to finish these 30 days out. And then we're still going to keep doing reactions to, to Nightwish. Don't worry. It's not just 30 days. Uh, we'll just move on to new artists and then, you know, add add them in there every now and then so anyway guys we're gonna continue our 30 days tomorrow i love all of you guys if you guys like this sort of thing do me a favor hit the sub button all that good shit y'all know what to do with it i'm gonna get out of here thank y'all so much for watching we'll catch you on the next one tomorrow remember everybody stay nuclear peace